Slender tutorial. Okay, guy, I'm gonna explain you my abilities that I use when I use the Gunslander. So, in this option, we got two options for level five. We got the uh, you only choose the right one because I never ever aim. I never aim because when you aim, you aim to the body, not to the head. And always, I want to switch my weapons really fast so I choose the right skill because I, I'm gonna move more faster and I'm gonna switch the weapons more faster so I choose the right one and the fight skill I remember some time I played with the Gunslander with the first uh, skill the left one this is a disaster I was saying why I got a lot of recoil and that was the reason so if you choose the right one is the best one to be a gunslander. This is the best one, definitely. For talking about the second one, I prefer, like I said, I always shoot to the head. So I always shoot to the head, so it's better for make more damage only to the head. So I always prefer this one, not the right one. For the 15th level, I choose the right one because I want to switch my weapons uh, and I want to reload it really faster like a faster reload and the full skill I choose the left one because the flash pan or the scrape can catch me they can catch me because they get slow and the last one is of the skill I prefer use the right one because in the set times you shoot really fast and you can switch your weapons you can reload really faster. It's really, really damn shit. It's really good. Okay, so now I'm gonna talk about the movement. Alright, we're talking about the movement. I only use the left stick. Like you see on the video, I move back and forward the left side. I don't use the right, right stick for nothing. Because it's really bad. I'm, I'm showing an example. Imagine that there is a head right there. So, this is how you have to move. So I'm gonna show you an example why you don't do it. Don't move the right stick. Don't move the right stick. Because you don't gonna have more precision. Look, this is don't you don't have to do. The correct force is that one. Left stick and you will see the heads really easy. You see it? Don't aim. Never aim with the goons longer. If you aim you aim to the body. I'm showing you the examples. Never aim. Look. Used to the body. Used to the body. Body. And to the body. So never aim when you're using a gun slander. You can see the examples. And you have to learn to run in your back. It's really important that you know the map. Never aim. It's all the most important things about the Moon Blunder. Look, use the left stick. Left stick. Left stick. Left stick. Easy, right? Alright guys, I will show you how to start the games with a pistol. It's really, really amazing to use the pistol just starting the game. I really love it because it's really fast, you got a lot of ammo, you got 15 bullets, so it's just stunning and amazing. I'm showing you the video for you see how effective it is. I don't like a lot of the revolver because it has a lot of recoil and it takes too much time for reload. So I'm showing you guys the video, always, always start with the pistol make a lot of kills yeah and it's really really effective so i hope you like it guys i want to show you even my advices my experience if you see the video i never ever aim just like i told before if you aim you don't gonna shoot to the head Lo ha 
¡Cuántas balas! Alright, now we're gonna talk vamos, about the revolver. Revolver! It's not one of my best. For me, I don't like it. We have too much dispersion and don't make a lot of damage. The reload is really slow. Really slow. So I don't like the revolver. I use as a secondary weapon. I use a secondary weapon every time. Okay, guys? So if I need the second round, I buy the N1911 pistol. But I don't like the revolver at all. It's not my favorite one. So this is my advice. You left like the ultimate option because you don't have more ammo. But this is not my favorite one. Another suggestion guys, never shoot to the head to roll it. Because you waste your bullets. ¿Qué tenemos aquí, señores y señoras? All right, let's talk about the secondary weapon, like $350 weapon. We're gonna start with the winter bikes. I personally don't like it. Don't freeze the rubber, don't make a lot of damage. For my opinion, I don't like it. That's my suggestion. So I prefer the pistol 1911. It's just amazing for the second wave. If you are playing Hell on Earth 10 waves, it's amazing in the second wave. I use it. I reload everything. Guys, don't make the mistake to buy a Desert Eagle in the second round. Don't do that. Buy the 1911. Have a lot of ammo. Don't have any recoil. Fast reload, I make a lot of damage on the head. This is one of my favorite weapons. If you are starting 10 waves hell on earth, this is the second wave you have to buy. Don't buy the desert eagle. Don't do what you are starting player 2. I'm showing this weapon, but I don't really like it at all. I'm trying to give you all my advice, guys. I got like three years playing, killing four two. So never buy a desert eagle in the second way. Buy the pistol, 1911, and maybe one desert eagle. This is health for all the little monsters and have a lot of ammo. I just love it. Rock and roll! Eliminado, colega! Well, guys, now we are going to talk about the Desert Eagle. One of my favorite weapons. All right, Desert Eagle. Five for the four or five ways. Never buy it in the second wave, like it's told you guys. Never buy it in the second wave. I prefer to buy. Two pistols, 1911, and one Desert Eagle for big monsters. But never buy this Desert Eagle, okay? The Desert Eagle is really amazing. Makes a lot of damage, have a lot of ammo, fast reload, and a lot of capacity ammo. 
So I just love it. For medium monster. I don't want to waste my bullets in little things like this. You see? So it's amazing for medium set. Or a team to kill the monster. Really amazing and one of my favorite ones. Now we're gonna talk about the walls. AF 2011. I don't like it. It's my personal opinion. There are a lot of people that like this weapon, but I don't like it. Have too much dispersion bullets, don't make the same damage, uh, have a lower penetration. I just don't like it. I prefer a Desert Eagle 100 times. Desert Eagle better. And it doesn't compare with the Magnum. You see the video, I can kill the monster. But I prefer the Magnum. Okay guys, this is my suggestion. You don't have a lot of penetration. There's a little one shot in the chest. That's it. Too much dispersion. Alright, the Magnum 500. I love it. You only use it with the spray, water, on flesh pound. Only use it for the big monsters. I'm using it the video for you see the damage. But I only use it with the flesh pound, it's crates, or water, or rubber. At some point, yeah? So this is my opinion. If you are in the sixth wave, don't buy the Magnum if you don't have a Desert Eagle and you don't have a pistol. This is the last weapons that I buy, okay? This is only for spray and flesh pounds. Now, I will show you a gameplay. Alright, now I'm gonna show you a real situation for ways with all my weapons. Four ways colonel. When I get a lot of monsters, I use the Desert Eagle. A lot of monsters, I use the Desert Eagle. You see Robux? So I'm using the Desert Eagle. Then I'm gonna see. I'm gonna use the 1911 for little sets. And then I just stick up the Magnum for don't waste my bullets. Really easy to kill a quarter with a maximum. Why shoot? And a little bit for finish the monster. You always have to reload all your weapons in all time. That's what I do every time. If I kill two sets, I reload. One. I reload. I reload. Then I reload. Then reload. When I finish, I kill a set. You see, I'm reloading. I take care of my 1911 for little set. That's high wars, guys. So, Magnum for big sets. Desert Eagle for medium sets and 1911 for a little oh, set. Sí. That's how I play. So now, I hope the tutorial helps a lot, you guys. It helps a lot. So I'm just trying to give you my best opinion, all my experience in this video. I hope you like it and you enjoy. Finish the video, guys. 
I wanted you to see, most of my time, I run on my back. I know the map. Most of my time, I run in my back. Never stay in one place. Never. Because you are going to die. Don't forget to use the weapon for every situation. Now I see this. Brothers. And I take care of the Magnus when I in travel. And the Desert Eagle shoot normal weapon. I think that maybe I'm dangerous a little bit. I take the Then I go back to my pistols. These pistols are good. To kill, a half, to kill another half really easily on the head. Only five two. Have a lot of ammo, that's what I like. It. So these are my favorite weapons. I don't even use the grenades. I don't use grenades for anything. And I got a lot of ammo. I hope you like the movements that I teach you. I hope you like to show you my best weapons. The Magnums are just incredible. This is for medium monsters, the Desert Eagle, I love it for Titan, Bloat, Rotors, I like the Desert Eagle, it's really good, yeah, and the Magnum is for the big monster. My Desert Eagle are completely full, yes. and I already with a lot of ammo in hell on earth hope you like it guys take care subscribe and put a like